time to cook. I got some chicken here. two, four, six, eight. So eight chicken ties right here in front of me. Uh, one of my subscribers sent this recipe to me. Shout out to you, Gary, here. I might flash it here so you guys can see. Really, really sorry that I don't have a white pepper. I do have black pepper right here. I love to use at home. And also, I, I don't have the chicken legs. I have chicken ties, bone in, skin on, and I am going to follow all the ingredients that you list right here. All the ingredients that I have in front of me. And I have it all ready so we don't uh, waste any time. I'm gonna start with some salt. We have black pepper here. is um, onion onion powder there's a little bit of salt in this so I'm not gonna put a lot spread it all over okay oh I love thyme guys thyme leaves there's just no getting over you let me see okay I'm gonna be using this here's our thyme spread it all over beautiful um, parsley you still love me for the rest of your life I got a lot of love I don't want to let go and go on I can't go on one tablespoon of parsley will you still love me for the rest of your life if it includes chicken and potato that means it's delish. All right, I just couldn't resist it. Where are we? Next will be uh, mustard. Right here, guys, our ground mustard. All right, just one, all right? There, all of that. And then we are almost done. Next will be half teaspoon of oregano. Oh, I love oregano entero, guys. Here's our oregano. <laughs> All the spices I'm using here are not sponsored. So let's go ahead and add some half teaspoon of our oregano entero so here it is spread it like that mm, this gotta be good guys because the spices i put here are my favorite the red pepper now i don't want this to be so spicy because the kids don't eat the chickens if it's too spicy and i put everything all of my chickens here so i'm not 
gonna be the only one eating this so i'm just gonna be easy with my cayenne peppers mm -hmm. so before i mix it up I want you guys to have a closer look of our spices mixed in with our chicken thighs. Isn't that look so amazing? Amazingly spices. Those spices are really, really good. Wait till I mix them up and it's sure gonna be delicious. Since we all love chickens in this house and potatoes and veggies. So I'm sure this is gonna be, taste so yummy. Let me just wash my hands one more time. And I think I'm just gonna use tong. Okay, now we forgot to add olive oil. Alright, so now we said set the oven to 180 and my oven is set to Fahrenheit. So I'm just gonna go ahead and set it to 355. Close enough. 356, uh, 355. Alright. So that is set to 355 Fahrenheit and he said um, turning every 15 minutes. All right. Now, one more time. So while waiting for the oven, I'd like to wash these potatoes. I didn't have the yellow potato here right now, but I think this will work. It's still potato and I hope you don't mind. Okay, so now it is wash now it is time to coat it with some oil I'm gonna use coconut oil this time I actually got this one from Walmart I'm not sure really how much was it but it was in clearance sale like, I'm gonna show you guys the other one all the way like that one <laughs> this one because it was in clearance sale so this is what i'm gonna be using for our um, potatoes so let's hurry up before the oven gets ready for everything let me just grab some knife we want to make a hole so that they don't blow up The songs that I have sung echo in a distance like the sound of a windmill going round. Alright my dearest, I am so ready to put this in the oven. It involves chicken and potatoes. Like I said, it really is a big banger for me. Enough with my drama and let's put it inside. It's really, really hot. Ah! Ooh. 
Oh, don't cook and wear this outfit. It's not too comfortable. It's not easy to make content and sell the videos, guys. I have to resort to this. So please, watch my video even though I don't dress up like a doll like this because oh, it's a lot of work. <laughs> Stick it in the oven, our um, potatoes. Put them here. I think I burned my finger. That's okay, the show must go on. All right, that is so ready now. And uh, we are just going to close this cover and I'm gonna put a timer for 15 minutes because we are gonna be interning the chicken as per the instructions by Mr. Gary of Australia. Let's close that. Normal, just wake up. Will you say hi? <gasps> Such a cute boy, you just wake up. So as you can see, I have a package here. It was arrived like two weeks ago, but I just um, totally forgot to unbox this with you. Huh? I'm gonna unbox my box, come here. Hey, stop ignoring me, come here. Sweetest. <laughs> oh, you keep crying there. Hmm? Say hi to our viewers, say hi guys. <laughs> So, my belly is growing guys, I'm very very hungry, it's a cooking utensil. Okay, we have the strainer, cute little strainer, right here, oh, a measuring cup. The big one is one cup, right here. And the small one is 1.8 or 30 ml. Okay. Next, what we have here, a big spoon. Okay, so what is this, guys? And comes with this silicone kitchen cooking utensil set. It has 32 uh, pieces inside, high heat resistant, DPA free non-toxic and this is not sponsored this is actually from my viewer Ayan. wow i like it it's not too bad it is silicone and it's like um gray or like it's not white but heat resistant so we are going to um and wrap oh there's a measuring spoon also aside from having a measuring cups it also comes with this cute little uh, measuring spoons okay that's not too bad it really is a lot in that box and so there's gonna be new additions to my utensils here in the kitchen so the next time you will be seeing them and my videos that I have new kitchen tools right here in front of you guys I'm loving it and there's this like a little hooks but it looks like that this hook is for this kind of look like that so I don't know if you will be able to see this it's a little bit far you can only see my tits a little bit closer mm -hmm. and that's that's about it so if you have like a thing in the kitchen like say for example here so kind of look like that like that all right that's the purpose of this one let me remove all the plastics and put them in the dishwasher Alright guys, and let's check our chicken. Oh, by the way, whoever sent this, thank you so much. There you go. It's gonna turn it as per us um, instructions. It smells so good. There you go. Hey guys, I'm gonna be doing these quick dishes here. Waiting for the chicken, might as well, right?
think they're almost done too. Grab some broccoli. We have vegetables here. So I'm just gonna cut like a little bit and then have my corn ready also. Let me grab that as well. This is my super sweet corn. Sorry, I'm using this knife, guys. It's not a butter knife, but hope you don't mind. So I'm just gonna stick the butter in the middle. Get some cheese. Super duper yummy and easy to make this baked potato. Just scrub it, wash it, put holes in it, stick it in the oven, bake it for one hour. You can use those big yellow um, potatoes. A Washington potatoes is what they call it thing and then I would like to uh, top it off again with some parmesan cheese since I love cheese okay there we go now we are gonna plate it put some chicken and some veggies we got a lot of food right here my dearest now finally the taste test is here i can't wait to eat i'm super hungry i have been in this kitchen for six hours <laughs> this is pretty much very easy it's just uh the filming getting the nice angles for you guys for the videos is very time consuming so that is why it took like six hours to just film this whole thing and i'm starving so let's jump right straight to our tasters i cannot wait any longer so like i said we have corn here broccoli and our baked potato and of course the star of this meal our chicken thighs and i added some white rice i hope you don't mind gary and we have our gravy let's go ahead and get our first bite let me start with some chicken yay i love crispy chicken skin okay guys so first bite mm. chicken skin So delish my god this is very good I really love it I can't stop I need to have another bite <laughs> or more off the camera I'm gonna be finishing this not the whole potato but probably most of them so another bite mm. Mm -hmm. potato cheers mm. some corn mm. broccoli have some veggies keep you guys healthy mm. Mm. so yummy guys i can't wait to finish this meal i will end the video here guys to finish this not all of them but most probably i will eat the whole chicken whole rice and just one potato and drink the whole gravy <laughs> i want to thank you guys for your precious time for joining with me today and thank you so much gary for giving me this recipe i hope you guys are having an amazing day please don't forget to give this video a thumbs up share subscribe if you haven't yet and i will see you guys on the next upload please stay safe everyone